Imagine you're just doing your job, working for your hard-earned money. So you decide to take a break and have some relaxing time off. But during your break, while you're sitting down and relaxing, you accidentally press the delete button and you lose all of the hard work you did. Now your boss is gonna fire you, you lose your job, money, and kids. Okay, that might not actually be very realistic, but we've all accidentally deleted some files or noticed too late that we deleted files that we didn't want to delete. But data recovery is actually a lot easier than people think. So yes, you can get those files back. Here's how you can recover deleted files. We're going to use the EasyUS data recovery software. I'll have the link for it in the video description. They're a well-known company, so no sketchy stuff here. When you get to their website, just press download. When you open the exe file, just follow the installation wizard. It's pretty self-explanatory. Now, after it's installed, it'll give you clear instructions for how to recover files, but I'll explain it a little more in detail. As you can see, you can recover data from external files or even from the cloud as well. Now you can either search your entire drive for deleted files or specific folders for if you know where it already was. Because searching bigger areas will take a longer time, so it'll be a lot quicker if you already know where you have to look. So let's test this real quick by creating a test file in this specific folder. Now let's fully delete it. Normally you'd think this file is gone forever, right? Well, let's search that folder with the recovery tool we just downloaded. And there it is. Now it's best to recover files to a different drive than the one you're recovering it from, or the file might get corrupted. So stick a USB stick in there or something. And after pressing recover, we've got the file back. It's that easy. But that seems a little too easy, right? If you delete stuff, why doesn't it just go away? Well, it's actually pretty interesting how this works. So let me explain how data is stored on a computer. Well, let's pretend real quick that this circle is your hard drive or SSD. It has a bunch of bytes, which we will represent as these little boxes. When you write something to these boxes, they get used. So let's say this little square here is some random file, like a video file. When you delete that file, it doesn't actually go away. It just gets marked and made invisible. So the drive will continue to use all these boxes until they've all been used up. And only when it almost gets full, will it start replacing these marked boxes. So until the drive is full, this file just exists, but it's just made invisible for you. So everything that the data recovery software does is just make that invisible file visible again. And then you can take it out. But keep in mind, if it gets overwritten, there's a good chance you won't get it back. It might be corrupted, or you might be lucky and you can actually get it back. So there's always a good chance to try. Now it's only free up to two gigabytes of recovered data. So you do have to get a paid plan if you want to recover more than that but they do have special prices for students. So if you're a student, you'll get a pretty nice discount. And if you're recovering some important data, in my opinion, that price is worth it. So yeah, that's pretty much it. I have a flight to catch. Well, I do say. Catch me, catch! <laughs>